What's up guys? Welcome to the Macintosh Review. I am back with another tutorial teaching you guys how to get jailbreak goodness on your iPhone, iPad, or iPod Touch without actually jailbreaking your device. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to install jailbreak themes without a jailbreak whatsoever. You do not need Cydia to do this. Absolutely awesome. Let's jump right into it. Now this works on iOS 10. This will work on the most recent iPhones. I'm going to be doing this on my iPhone 7. Does not require a jailbreak. Will work on all the most recent iPads and iPod Touches as well well on iOS 10. Now the install process is pretty simple just like all the other guides I've had here on my channel. All you have to do is open up Safari here. You can see that I am on the website. It is called iEnchantify.net. So you're going to want to go ahead and load up that website on your device. The link will be down there in the description. It's I-E-N-C-H-A-N-T-I-F-Y.net and this is the home page of the website. As you guys can see, super awesome. They have a really cool description right here. They tell you that they can bring you tons of apps, tweaks, and packages for your iOS device that you cannot usually get without a jailbreak. Yes, you can download applications, but I've found that this website specifically is best for themes, and like I said, that's what this video is about. So to get the themes, as you guys can see on the homepage, they have a lot of different things here. For example, hacked games and that sort of a thing. Themes, you click the upper left option menu here, and you can see themes right there. Go ahead and click that. It will bring you to a screen that shows a lot of themes that you can definitely just download straight to your device. So you can pick and choose. You want to see a theme that says free underneath it. Those are the ones that you can install with no hassle whatsoever. So you can see exactly what it looks like here. You can actually even zoom into them, I believe like that so you can see exactly what it's going to look like on your device and all you have to do to install it is go ahead and click install. I'm going to scroll down and click one that looks a little bit different here Galaxy S3 just to show you guys that it works. I'm going to go ahead and click install and this one actually pops me directly into the settings application. I believe that's what all the themes do. If they don't they will give you a download link that will eventually link you to the settings application and all you have to do is go ahead and click install up here in the upper right. Enter your passcode. Go ahead and click next in the upper right. Go ahead and click install again. Install again. You might have to do this a few times. Go ahead and click done. It'll jump you back into Safari. All you have to do is go ahead and click the home screen. You will see that all the way over to the right, you will have new application icons installed right there on your device. Now, some of these actually have better customization options than others. Like I said, this is the Galaxy S3 theme. If you install one of these more modern iOS looking themes, you probably will have a better chance of having more icons, more applications to deal with. But the way it works is basically it installed a profile onto your device. All you have to do is go ahead and click the application itself, it will open that application. So for example, I'll click Safari, it'll open up and launch Safari directly there. Some of the applications actually link to Safari, which will then open up the application itself. Really, really cool stuff, guys. Absolutely free. You can actually delete icons, I believe, using wiggle mode, as you guys can see here. And that's really all there is to it, guys. So really, it's not as good as theming on Cydia, but it definitely gets the job done. If you want to remove the theme itself, all you have to do is go into the settings application, go into to general, then profiles and device management, and you will see the theme that you downloaded. Go ahead and click delete, enter your passcode again, delete one more time, and it will remove it from your device. Go back to your home screen here, and you will see that all of those icons are no longer on my device, and the theme has been removed. Super easy, guys. No hassle, no jailbreak required. Absolutely awesome website, iEnchantify.net. So hopefully you guys liked this video. It was a short and sweet one. Wanted to show you guys this cool, simple, streamlined way of installing themes on your iOS 10 device. I did this on my iPhone 7 running iOS 10.0.2. This is the most streamlined way I found to do it. Absolutely awesome. The easiest way I found. So hopefully you guys enjoy it. Anyway, if you like this video, be sure to stick around and rate thumbs up and subscribe for more content. Also be sure to follow me on my Twitter page, my website page, my Facebook page, and my Google Plus page all down there in the description. Those are excellent ways to follow me. So be sure to check out the links in the description to get paid iOS and Android apps 100% percent free and enjoy the themes guys check out my other videos to install jailbreak apps without jailbreaking on ios 10 down there in the description and thanks for watching guys as always stay awesome and i'll catch you guys in the next video peace